Howdy folks, it's Meandering Mike in the Man Cave of Madness. It is uh, in the middle of the late morning, and we are doing a product unboxing, not of a game, but of an accessory that I've talked about a number of times on the channel. That's Plasti Bands. These are from Bomb Gardens. It's the Conserve Plasti Bands. Uh, they are substitutes for rubber bands. Rubber bands are bad. Rubber bands are uh, too stretchy and then eventually break. They, they get old and decay over time. They can leave marks on, say, your card decks uh, or stick and break and leave residue on your box or, or whatever that you put rubber bands on. Plasti bands do not have that problem. Now, one thing about plasti bands is they are stretchy, but they're not quite as stretchy as rubber bands, and they don't bounce back as much, which means you want to use an appropriate size one. You want one that's going to be, you know, you stretch a little bit to put on so it's not loose, and it'll, it'll hold that shape, though, when you stretch it to a certain degree. So, I recommend... This, if you're going to get one thing of plastic bands, this is 100 pieces of assorted sizes. There's basically 1 inch, 2 inch, 3 inch, 4 inch, and 6 inch sizes. Now, there's a fraction, like it's 4 and a quarter inches, or 3 and an eighth, or, or maybe it's 3 and 5 eighths. I remember, they're, they're, they're slight with, with a fraction on them, but basically 1, 2, 3, 4, and 6. Now, on the back here, it tells you how many you get of each kind. This is wrong. This double what you do. This... This adds up to 200. I don't know why. This For years, I've been getting these for years. This has been wrong in the back. There are 100 pieces in here. Um, if you get a lot of games, like like as we see here, this is an MMP box, and a GMT box, compass games. These are the perfect size for those. And you might want to get a 100 pack of just the four and a quarter. If you do a lot of card games, this has one inch and two inch size in it. They do sell a separate two inch size. Here we can get a hundred of those. If you play a ton of card games, um, you know, deck builders or collectible card games, living card games, etc., you might want to get the two inch size. But this is what I usually do. Now, this here is an example of one of my reduce, reuse, recycle. I'm reusing this box. This is ring, which was like a, I guess the, the ring camera for the front door uh and i just this is what i store in here i go and i sort into plastic bags they are, they are color coded in here these are always the same the six inch ones are the green the three inches are the white the two are the blue the black are the one inch and the red are the four inches now these are all four inches and they come in a variety of colors including red, green. So so there's a green here that's four inch and a green here that's six. So I, I, I sort them to make sure that, you know, here's all my six inch bands. These are blue two inch bands. And so I, I've used all my blue four inch bands, but if I go and sort these and put these into the various bags here, four inch, three inch. These are good for roughly like a, six by nine inch box with some thickness. These can also be used, these three inch bands. And I, uh, let's see, if I can, whoop, see the actual size there. That's three and five eighths, if I'm reading that right. My eyes are trying to focus. Um, these will work on an eight and a half by 11 size box or nine by 12. If it's not too thick, it'll, it'll, it'll It'll be nice and, and, and snug with, you know, enough stretchiness, easy to get off. Um, but six by nine type boxes, eight and a half by 11 if they're not too thick. But anything, you know, definitely two inches or above, you want to use the four inches for these kind of GMT boxes, etc. cetera. Um, but you can use the three inches from here. So uh, let's try to wrap it up here. Uh, obviously, I don't use, have as many card games as some people do, so I end up getting a lot of a lot of these um the six inch bands that are here <laughs> i i have a bunch that i need to reband either don't have a bands or have rubber bands on them or stuff that like you know as, as i've been taking things out of storage and getting them organized in the man cave 
the uh, no, that's the four inches. These guys, the the greens in here, they're they're wider too. Things that are are very broad. Things like uh, the game Supremacy or those American Heritage games or uh, Barbarian and Kingdom and Empire, Decline and Fall. There's a a lot of uh, the um, international team ones that come from Italy and. There's a number of games that are very large form factor. They're often not really thick, but they're <laughs> they're, they're two flat dimensions are, are, are quite big. And so those are quite nice for those. So, um, hmm, pick measure in there. Uh, so I, I guess that's pretty much all I want to say. Uh, these are available on many online retailers, you know, whether it's your Walmart or your Amazon or, uh, I mean, easily more than a half dozen to a dozen online vendors. If you search for Plasti Bands, <laughs> you know, you, you can, you know, so shop around. The price can range from like $7 to $15, you know, for one of these, depending on the, the, the retailer. So definitely look around uh, for the ones in the 7 to $8 range. Um, so, you know, if you take care of their games, they'll take care of you. Use a nice archival quality plasti band instead of rubber bands. And, you know, years later, your components, will, I mean, I've opened many a used game to find, ah, uh, you know, tightly wound rubber bands that have been double or triple wound. And they said use the appropriate size um, that had left dents on the side marks on the cards and residue sticky stuck onto cards you know as like the, the rubber bands kind of melt uh, over time especially if they're under pressure um so try them out plasti bands conserve plasti bands from bomb gardens find them online it's a good investment you know if again if you're only gonna get one this one has a nice variety of sizes all the way from one to six inches and that'll do you the best. But if you're a big collector like me, got a lot of GMT, MMP, Compass Games, Old Avalon Hill, bookcase games, etc., etc., bingo, get both. <laughs> All right, folks, Meandering Mike in the Man Cave of Madness. This has been a public service announcement. Don't forget to reduce, reuse, recycle, and take care of your game stuff, and it'll take care of you. Take care, everyone, and ciao.